the first rights, the first obligatory rights that you need to give God. You need to understand and you give God Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is this right. At-Tawheed, the oneness of worship. You must not worship anyone. You know, we've said it several times. That when you say worship, it does not mean until you stand, you sit, you bow, you genuflect, you prostrate. All these they are included. Asking, calling, seeking for success, seeking, seeking for childhood, seeking for our uh, seeking for anything that you know that is it goes beyond the human capability, then you direct it to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So it's not it's part of shirk when you call upon Muhammad to save you, to protect you, to guide you, to give you, to fight for you. You don't call on Muhammad, you don't call on anyone, you don't call on Jesus or Abraham or anyone. You call upon God, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala alone. Allah says in the Quran, Kama qala ta'ala, the Sheikh also uh, gave us another reference. When Allah says in Quran, Quran chapter 4 verse 36, Wa'abudu Allah, Allah says, Wa'abudu Allah, wa la tushiriku bi shay'a, wa bil walidayni ihsana. Worship Allah alone. You must not associate any partner in the worship of Allah. You must not direct your worship to anyone. Not Muhammad, not Jesus, not Moses, not anyone except to whom? Allah alone. To God, Allah alone. Only Him. So, Allah, worship Allah alone. Do not associate partners in the worship of Allah. This is the second obligation. Be kind to your parents, to your fathers, to your mothers. This is the second obligation upon you. The first obligation is to give worship to Allah alone and not to associate partner in the worship of Allah. Then you need to be kind to your parents. Another verse in the Quran, Allah says, وَقَضَى رَبُّكَ أَلَّا تَعْبُدُوا إِلَّا إِيَّا Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has decreed, it is a decree of Allah, that you must not worship any other one except Allah alone. Only God you must worship. وَبِلْوَالِدَيْنِ إِحْسَانًا Then the second obligation is to be kind to your parents. وَقَالَ تَعَالَى Another verse of the Quran, قُلْ تَعَالَوْا عَتْلُ مَا حَرَّمَ رَبُّكُمْ عَلَيْكُمْ Allah says, O oh Muhammad, call them, call the universe. عَتْلُ مَا حَرَّمَ عَلَيْكُمْ Let me recite you, let me teach you what God has made forbidden upon you. أَلَّا تُشِرِكُ بِإِشَيَانِ You must not associate any deity or any partner in the worship of Allah. Don't call the name of anyone except God alone. وَبِلِوَالِدَيْنِ إِحْسَانَ And you ought to be kind to your parents, your fathers, and to your mothers.